Now the weather, one of the spots hit hardest tonight, Gallatin County. Dispatchers telling nine on your side there are power lines and trees down all across the area. Nine on your side's Jason Law went down to survey the damage from tonight's storm. There are a lot of reports of widespread damage along Craig's Creek in Warsaw and other parts of Gallatin County. Here at Pier 99, the roof of a structure was completely ripped off and blown over onto a houseboat where it rests right now here in the dark. We've also seen a lot of downed power lines, tree branches, and other types of structural damage. 62-year-old Dan Jenkins was here at Pier 99 when the storm rolled in around 8 p.m. It's my opinion that the winds were 75, 80 miles per hour or more. You must have been pretty scared. Yeah, well, I was shook up, and I, used, I always thought I was pretty calm and collected, but I found out not. And we've been through a lot of 60 and 70 mile an hour winds here before and haven't had this kind of trouble. I mean, everything's pretty well built and can handle it, but I, it must have been a pretty severe updraft that came and just pulled everything up. I, I honestly think there must have been a tornado that touched down right over here or, or started to and did some damage and maybe when it came back up and flew over this way it took my roof off. Jason Jenkins says the damage is actually worse at Smuggler's Cove just a short distance from here. Monday night a lot of people are left in the dark with power outages all throughout Gallatin County. Jason Law, 9 on your side.